Is there a game on right now? If there's a game on, I'll watch it. It's GG versus TSM. That sounds <laughs> trash. All right, on one hand, you have Keith coming in who, right, they brought him from the AD carry position. Yeah, and he sucks he, dick. Expectations had to be pretty low, right? He's role swapping. <laughs> expectations were incredibly low. And he's underperformed expectations. I got a question. Why hasn't the game started yet? Bjergsen looks like my grandpa's younger brother. That's cool. They look like they're having fun. That's good too. Nothing wrong with a little fun. Don't pick Jarvin, bro. Alright. This team fucking sucks. <laughs> I'm I'm pretty sure Golden Guardian's about to get fucking slapped out here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they're about to get the shit slapped out of them. I don't know these matchups, so I'm assuming that Orin does well versus Aatrox. I don't think Kiana beats Zoe, but I don't think it fucking matters because the Jarvan's gonna get the shit slapped out of him, and then I'm pretty sure that Keith. I mean, all I know is that. Oh, is it Orn Mitt? Okay, I'm pretty sure that's a lot better, but... I'm pretty sure Kiana tops fucking trash. Yeah, Orn Mitt's pretty good. It literally just AFK clears waves, and you can't really do anything versus it. I mean, I'm pretty sure the game's just gonna be around top lane. Because I'm... I feel like if Hanser... I think he plays Aatrox right. He should be able to smash, or not smash, but like pressure the fuck out of Kiana. I mean, bot lane shouldn't die. And mid lane's literally an AFK lane, so the only fucking lane that can do anything is fucking top. I'm pretty sure Aatrox could just fucking heal up most of this shit, right? So I definitely feel like uh, Golden Guardians is a better early game. But then again, the. Jarvan wasted a lot of time. Oh, uh, if he hits this shit, he's dead. Well, Hanser went so far away. What? I don't know what the fuck that was. That was... That should have been a free fucking kill. Especially because the, or the fucking Jarvan has a sweeper, so he can keep track of the dude the whole fucking time. That was... Some bad shit. That was some real bad shit. I mean, their Jarvan just keeps wasting so much time doing useless shit. He's fucking dead as fuck, bro. <laughs> He's fucking dead as fuck. Wow, Golden tried to TP for that shit. What the fuck? I'm surprised they even collapsed for that. Did they really think they could save him? Like, literally, Kiana has a point and click CC into another CC, into Grog's body slam. There's no fucking way. But it's fine. Dardock takes turret aggro, just walks up and body slams full CC lock, and then he flashes. I don't know why he would TP for that. That was pretty bad. Like I said, I think Aatrox wins this matchup, but it don't matter matchups if you just fucking grief, because, yeah. That gank top lane into dying is pretty much. You're doomed. I I'm pretty sure he's gonna get fucked. Or he's not gonna get fucked. I'm pretty sure the Kiana is just gonna keep roaming and like putting pressure on everyone. And then they have to pray to God that Golden Glue can carry, but I don't think he's carrying versus Orn. Orn is such a fucking like wall. He's actually like impossible to do anything against. I mean, the only way that they're really gonna get anything accomplished this game, Golden Guardians, is bot lane now. Cause top lane was really how they win this shit, but cause he's already so behind now that they kind of have to just play off of bottom. I'm pretty sure they can't do this. Or maybe they just don't even give a fuck. 
I guess they don't even give a shit. Is the choice of whether this rift was worth it. Yes, they get the rift herald, but look at the bottom line. It's two plates that go over to Zaya as well as farm. How many plates could they get? Wow, they just rotated top lane to try to get Aatrox out of this lane. That's fucking. That's pretty giga brain. That's a good rotation right there. That was a good as fuck rotation, bro. That was clean. I mean, they're just trying to help their Aatrox because he's fucking useless and he's like, like I said, he's the win condition. So they need him to like actually be relevant. And if he's just getting blasted by fucking Kiana, he's never going to be relevant. Not bad. Yeah, the Kiana got the plates, but the plates don't matter. It's just about freeing the Aatrox from like... Because if he's stuck laning, he's just going to be on the tower, and he's pretty much just going to get tower dove. But because he can fucking rotate first, because his team's rotating and the Kiana has to stay to defend, he always has the first move, so... He's always in an advantageous position. I mean, the person that gets to move first has the advantage, so... Like, now Aatrox is going back top, and the Kiana, she can't 2v1 their bot lane, so... This is pretty good. I mean, Golden Guardians is doing a good job with the rotation. They just have to make sure they don't die to Kiana, because she can pop them fucking easily. Yeah, like, again, Kiana just had a recall and fucking run over again. Like, she's pretty much trying to fucking chase him, because she can only beat the Aatrox, so she has to lane versus Aatrox, but if Aatrox is just constantly fucking rotating, the Kiana can't do anything, because she doesn't want to be laning versus someone else. I mean, it's kind of fucking over, uh... Golden Guardians bot lane, but honestly, they're fucking useless anyway, so who gives a fuck? What a redirect! What a way to click ulti in a direction. Wow, he didn't heal him. Okay, well, all those rotations didn't matter because they just griefed that. Well. Alright, well, GG lost. Like, literally just off that, they already lost. Well, that was unfortunate. Hey, they were doing a good job, though. That was, like, pretty impressive, the rotations and shit. Kill him. Kiana mechanics. Him using his E into Q, which makes it undodgeable, and stuns, and then using his other stun. Nice fucking mechanics, dude. I mean, this game is going to be hard as fuck to come back from now because they really needed Kiana to not get stronger because they were doing a good job of putting a leash on her. But now she's going to start to get to run wild and they have to just avoid dying. And that's really fucking hard to do versus a champ that could literally point and click and insta kill you. Oh, smack Hanser's bitch ass. Hug. I mean, like I said, they needed to keep him on a leash, and now he's just gonna run wild and kill everyone. Yeah, the game's fucking dumb. Like, literally, this is competitive. One play, and it's over. Like, they made that literal one play, and then... You can't come back from that. I mean, you can't come back from it. I mean, that's not competitive. That's an A. But yeah, like... 
The Hanser is just gonna be useless as fuck. Cause he can't 1v1 Kiana and Kiana can just clear the wave and go roam. And cause he can't 1v1, he can't push in the wave, so he's forced to- Well, maybe I guess I'll go match the roam. Ah, oh, she wasn't roaming, she was waiting for me and she killed me. I better go match the roam again. Ah, oh, she wasn't roaming, she was baiting me. He missed his E over the fucking wall, he's fucking griefing. Look at look at him on the bottom left. He's laughing, dude. He's like, I really missed that. E. <laughs> Are you kidding me, bro? I clicked over the wall and I missed it. Yep, you did. <laughs> I mean, there there really isn't much to watch off of this. Like, I literally, it's gonna be Kiana just constantly baiting Aatrox to the point where Aatrox will just be like, Yeah, you know what? I'm not going to help my team anymore. And then his team is just going to get 4v5'd and then they're going to lose. I mean, honestly, yeah, I think I think Golden Guardians did pretty well early game. They just, that one play fucked them over completely. Oh, that was sick. They're going for it, but he missed the ult. Yeah, Bifrost in there as well. Actually, really well played by Golden Guardians. Shooks left. Oh, we'll talk about it in a second. Bjergsen, ooh, tries to find the sitter. Dardock in as well. Not just yet. Oh, Bjergsen, just... Bro, I love watching Orange. I love watching Orange just face tank the team. <laughs> Orange just didn't give a fuck, dude. He just sat there face tanking him. I mean, losing the like towers don't really make a difference because towers are just like. It's just there. Like, it really doesn't matter if you lose all your fucking towers if the enemy team has no pressure. Like, losing it's... Sure. Have the mid tower, bro. That's all you. I still don't think they can deal with Kiana. Unless they can get a gank off on her. But Jarvin's fucking useless for the gank, so... It would have to be, like... Aphelios, Thresh, and someone else. But I don't see that ever happening, so... Yeah. Oh, you're fucking dead, bro. What are you doing? Bro, that ult, Ian. Yep, cause Aatrox got smashed. Uh, he played that bad. Kiana did. He, sh he shouldn't have died. He should have just sat in the fucking stealth. But he wanted to fucking make it cool looking. Like he, he should never R here. That's so fucking greedy. Dude, I... <laughs> I know casters have to sell the play, but like the hitbox of Kiana's fucking ulti is like two towers. You gotta be fucking blind to not see the angle there. I mean, honestly, if Golden Guardians don't get stomped into the ground once Baron is like being contested, they could actually win this game. I mean, will that happen? I don't think so, but... Uh, they can't do this shit. That was a nice fucking... That was an awful Orin ulti. What the fuck? Bro, just leave, Beer. Are you gonna run or are you gonna fucking help, bro? 
Okay, at least he didn't die. I don't know why they try to contest that after whatever his name just died. But yeah, I mean, like I said, they need to kill Broken Blade and they can win the game. So that's pretty fucking big. It, I mean, it's not big enough yet because they need to kill him multiple times. This Baron probably not going to help that much, but not bad. I don't think that TSM can contest this shit. I'm pretty sure TSM's going to die here if they try to contest it. I don't know if they're actually... I mean, they're killing Closer, which is pretty useless. Well, that's all right. They got a lot of summoners out of TSM, so that's pretty fucking good. Bro, as soon as he died, they should have just fucking ran. Or they should have tried turning with Orin ulti or like anything. Like, if Bjerg was helping, maybe they could do something in this fucking fight, but... Yeah, I don't think that was happening. If, if they can stop Kiana from fucking them one more time, then they can win. Because, I mean, I think Aatrox is a lot better than Kiana. The only reason I have faith in Kiana is because she got such an early lead, but now that the lead's getting, like, normalized... I mean, Aatrox is just gonna go back to shitting on Kiana. Like, she doesn't do enough damage to one-hit him, and then he can just lifesteal through. And Kiana can't really farm, so... I'm pretty sure that if they don't die here, that's good. That's a terrible... F TP, but whatever, sure. I mean, the thing with competitive games is team comps matter a lot. Especially, I don't I. This is like only an A because it's the only thing I have knowledge of. I don't know fucking other regions. But because games usually go to like 40 minutes because no one fucking does anything. The early game shit's like completely irrelevant. Like, Kiana fucking Aatrox matters if they close out the game early but because they're not doing that i mean who gives a fuck what happened in the early game like that shit really doesn't make a difference because aatrox is i'm pretty sure he's at the point now where he can just fucking clap out kiana in a 1v1 i think that tsm's comp is better aside from the kiana she's kind of worthless in here but whatever yeah, I said the game was going to be over in five minutes, but that's because I thought TSM knew how to push an advantage. They want to fight this shit GG does. TSM does not want to fight this because TSM is going to get fucking rolled here. Yeah, I thought TSM would, like, push their advantage into something. They do not want to fucking fight this shit. They're gonna get fucking... Alright, I'm pretty sure that Golden Guardians will shit on them. Okay, or he just dies. Does he not have Flash? Oh, he had Flash. He just didn't use it. Okay, well... Wait, Hanser and FBI both had Flash and they just died for free. Hmm. Bro, what am I... How am I supposed to fucking predict this shit? They both had flash and they both didn't use it and just died. Yeah, Aatrox didn't ulti either. I'm surprised he didn't ulti when, uh... I'm surprised that the, uh... Aatrox didn't ulti when Kiana eat on him. Because he knows he's getting all in right there. Like, this shit started off so good. Like, this looks good. Just flash out. Okay, sure, he doesn't flash out, but you have flash, AD. Flash. Okay, you just die for free. I mean, they, both their carries are dead, so the fight is over now. 
Now I'm pretty sure that he got out of that sh CC. I don't think they chained the CC. Can I rewatch this shit? No, whatever, I don't care. I'm pretty sure they didn't chain the CC perfectly. And also, uh, he could have just flashed immediately because he knew he was going to get wall stunned as soon as Kiana eat on him. And I mean, once Kiana E's on him, like, I mean, he's on the backside of you. I don't fucking know, bro. I mean, I guess this is TSM pushing a lead, right? Not bad. And I mean, on the bright side, honestly, at least their AD and their top laner still have flash, right? It's not going to be used for much because you can't really do anything versus the fucking Baron now, but yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure he had time to flash there. They shouldn't fucking have a Trox lane versus Kiana. They need him. Also, Aatrox is down three levels, so it's not like he can even fucking do anything. Yeah, the game's probably over now. I mean, Baron is... That shit's hard as fuck to beat. Like, the thing is, God, Jarvan's just such a trash fucking champion. You either get their early game off, like, you know these games are gonna go late. Why pick this champion? I don't know if regions play him a lot, but he is fucking garbage, dude. Like, this champ doesn't, like, look at him, dude. He's literally just pacing back and forth, just like, fuck you off from me, bro. I'm not going in on this shit. Yeah, like, there's a lot better champions that can play an early game and then transition into something. Bro, watch Jarvan here. Just watch him this entire time. He does literally fucking nothing. Like, they're not even... They don't even, like, consider him a champion. They're just completely ignoring him while they kill Thresh. I mean, I think Jarvan built damage is pretty good, but that shit's useless as fuck and competitive because, yeah, it's only good damage if you end the games early. If you go, like, if you're at 30 minutes and you're damaged, you're actually fucking useless. You die in one hit to anything. <laughs> it's not the flash! He's gonna get out. He said, hold up, hold up. He's going to maybe turn it when he's down three levels and he's on you as nothing. And he flashed nothing also. Yeah, there's, there's not really much to say about this game. <laughs> that shit doesn't matter, chunking beer. Oh, they gotta fucking contest this dragon, yeah. I didn't realize, wow, they had- GG has three dragons. If they could get this dragon, that would be big. And the scary thing about three dragons is you can just suicidally go for it like a fucking animal. Okay, they're dead as fuck. This is GG right here. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, it's GG. I mean, yeah, like I said, Broken Blade just fucking fucked Aatrox. I don't think that this should have been this bad, because I'm pretty sure Aatrox does well. But yeah, that like one play that they did on... uh. Near purple sides blue buff just like instantly lost the game for that. Like they were just so fucked from that. That was just such a fucking impossible game for him. 
don't think that's a good matchup. That's not. I'm, like a good matchup. I'm almost positive that's not a good matchup. Assistance from his team, Dardock and Bjergsen, Roman. It was just such a boring game, though, because it's like <laughs> the game was just decided so fast. I hate that kind of shit. Because GG was like actually doing those rotations they were doing to force the Kiana to like have to make decisions. That was good. But literally that one getting caught at the blue buff just lost them the game and then it, there's not even anything to watch then. Oh, guess we lost. Oh, good game, fellas. Watch Dig vs C9, bro. I almost fell asleep watching that last one. Fuck no, I'm not watching another.